morning everyone. I hope you're having a wonderful, beautiful Sunday today. I hope it's sunny and not raining where you are. It's pretty nice here and I'm going to be going outside in a little bit, but I wanted to make this video first. I got a purchase from Goodwill and I cannot believe I still got this. So the first thing, this is, I, I bet you I have over 200 yards of beaded trim that I found. The first one is this one. Isn't that pretty? It's kind of like a copper color and all these uh, beads are glass. They're not acrylic or anything like that, but they're all glass. They're all very heavy. And so that's my first one. Very pretty. The next one is this black one. And it's got kind of a long dangle to it. Nice, nice medium to long dangle. Very shiny. Very small. And this one. This one. Let's see if I can get it. It's, it's very short, but it's still usable. I can use this. Lots there. And I think this one's my favorite. Isn't that gorgeous? And the, the dangle on this one is fairly long also. Isn't that pretty? The iridescent. Gorgeous. And there is a lot there. I bet there's at least five yards there. This beautiful black one. And that's a fairly long one. Very pretty. Just a just wonderful and I bet you there's at least 10 yards on this card also and then this one very nice these are perfect for gypsy books and just all kinds of things you can use this on this one this one's got a fatter bead to it very very pretty and then this one, this one's a little smaller bead of the iridescent one. So I'll be able to combine those two and use this one. And then this one, very nice, medium length. This one's a navy blue. And then this one, this one's a brown, isn't that pretty? So you're going, oh, what are you going to do with these dark colors? Well, you got to have dark to go with your light. As you don't see your light. So this one is a really pretty multicolored one. Nice length to that. I would call that a long, a long dangle. Very pretty. These are all vintage. They're very old. This one, and I can use this on almost everything, except for maybe the very lightest shabby chic one, but I can still blend this. Let's see, where am I gonna go? This one, I love this one. Isn't that gorgeous? Very, very pretty. Let's see if I can get it through the side. Awesome colors. There's a ton here too. These are very heavy. This one, it's not much here, but it'll be enough for for one. When I need to, uh, when I make a jean pocket, <clears throat> I need at least a, a yard and maybe about four inches to do one pocket on both sides. So if I'm putting two and three different types of beads on a pocket, I'm going to be using almost four yards of beaded trim. Another little small black one. And this one I've never seen before. Look at this. This one's a nice long dangle. This one is either made out of wood or clay. And I think it's wood. I'm pretty sure it's wood. Isn't that cool? I've never ever seen a bead made out of wood or clay. And then this one 
is, I've never seen this one either. Let me see if I can find a pin to this one. But look, it's made into a loop. Isn't that cool? Very cool. I've never seen a loop dangled beaded trim. It's really, really nice. There's got to be at least five yards on this one also. Then I have just a little bit of this one. It's very nice. Very uh, gypsy or hippie, if you want to call it that. It's got some nice different colored beads on it on each one of the ends. So there might be two yards there. I have this one. Very cool. Lots there. And then this one. Is that pretty? Got two cards of those. And then this one was just laying loose in the box. I've never ever seen this one either. And this one, somebody, I believe somebody made this. And uh, it gave me a wonderful idea. So, you see that? All those are made by, um, uh, what's that? Eye pins. Eye pins and loops. And I don't think there's a jump ring on it. It's all eye pins and head pins. That's all glass, and they're very heavy. Very, very vintage. So I love this one. There's at least over a little bit of a yard on this one. And then I got this little card, the red one. So it's very cool. And then this one, little card. Nice brown one. And some of these were just loose in the box. This one came off of a scarf, I believe, but isn't that nice? Just a tiny bit here. It's enough for one page. Awesome. And then I would even use that, just a single one. And then this one also came off of a scarf. Let's see here if I can find the opening. this one and I can cut that off and use it on one page so there's three of these little pieces so that was my find of the century I am so happy I found all this I'm back in business now with my denim jean pockets I think this one's my favorite the loop one and um, so I'll be able to make some more and uh, share them with with you all and thank you for coming in and seeing my wonderful wonderful uh, purchase and all of this all of it including shipping was $32 so I, I can't beat that um, thank you everybody for uh, sharing part of your Sunday with me and we'll see you soon. Oh, I do have a little announcement. I'm going live tomorrow at 7 Eastern with a special guest, uh, Jeannie Dreamer. I'm only going to be on for a little bit, uh, not very long. And I'm going to show you how to make a sequence flower. So I hope you all stop by and see us tomorrow night at 7 on my channel. See you soon. Bye-bye.